Hey everybody, so today we get to actually mow the yard. This is going to be the first cut that I've done on the new seeded areas. They're growing in pretty fast, so I don't want to go ahead and let that get too tall. I want to be able to let the sun still get down in there and the water and the moisture. So it's always a good idea when you're doing a first cut to use as light of a mower as possible. I know this isn't something that everybody can do, but for me, I have kind of a small push mower. I'll show you right now. I actually got that for free on the side of the road on one of the junk days around here. It started up when I got it, but it was kind of running a little bit rough. I just cleaned out the carburetor and ever since then it's worked perfectly. Just a small little machine. The nice thing about it is it's super light. It's not the greatest cut in the world. It doesn't really rival my Time Master at all, but my Time Master is pretty heavy and I don't want to damage the seedlings that are still in kind of a delicate stage right now. So I'm going to take this little mower across the yard. Not sure exactly what height it is but somewhere right around right under three inches that I'm gonna be cutting at right now so let's go ahead and get mowing So that is the mowing portion for today. Just a reminder, it's always a good idea to have your blade sharpened right before you are cutting this new grass. I did mine just about a week ago or so. Everything's looking pretty good. I'll keep you updated on what's going on here in the next couple weeks as things grow in a little bit. We'll put a little more fertilizer down. So thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time.